and, and the photos disappeared for a while, didn't they? Well, my photographs, uh, Reed Miles, uh, let me see, Reed Miles, who shot the cover picture, had an odd uh, uh, method with his own photographs. He submitted them to, to Columbia, to Sony, to Columbia, and then he destroyed all his photographs, except these two that are on the album. He made his own editorial choices, and to make sure that no one second-guessed him, he would destroy his own photographs, his outtakes. So, uh, sadly, the, there, there would have been perhaps other pictures, some other great pictures that Reed himself shot. My pictures, uh, I never had done anything with them uh, commercially, but in getting t in touch through Jeff Rosen and, 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 and now meeting Jeff Gans, and, and what we're doing with these pictures is going back to the, to the set of photographs that I took, documentary style, uh, leading up to the album shoot itself. You know, so I don't have this exact shot. Reed, this is Reed's camera. But I have pictures that, that come up to and lead up to that moment. Well, and, and your photos then basically comprise the only really documentation photographically of that uh, of that particular session now, aside from the uh, from the cover shots. Then, right? They, the, I think they uh, they really open up uh, in in low in, in this book, which is a fabulous look at the period and, and the the. That the music was recorded, you can see in these photographs a little bit of what led up to that moment. Uh, for example, here's Bob coming in and shedding his civvy clothes and, and starting to get into costume. Uh, he picked this white poncho to start off with uh, and, and wore that around and ended up in this beautiful Mexican coat. Uh, every, you can see the ballerina getting ready here, Levon Helm is is dressing himself like for a wedding, and his wedding mate was Ed Anderson, our sound engineer, in a big Southern Belle dress with big pink emblazoned over it. It was a really odd photograph. Here's my brother Bill with Garth uh, getting uh, getting uh, getting dressed, and Garth tapping out a song on his tuba. I love that look on Garth's, uh, he's like looking out of the corner of his eye, a little well, askance. This, he's a droll man. Garth is such a cut up and, and, and so sh brilliant and shy and and uh, he's a real character without trying to be so. And I'm so pleased in, the, in, in putting this book together and the album together that Garth was able to uh, to be at the center of that. It, you know, it's a, it, I've seen some interviews with him and um, just, it makes my heart warm and, and very glad to see that. He's an amazing, amazing man. Very close. This is the nun who Lee, uh, Rick Danko is having a moment with. And uh, here's everybody getting a little high over in the corner, Bob and Levon and, and Robbie. Uh, and uh, this is uh, another photo. Here's a photo that shows Bob starting to bring everybody into the pose and, and, and finding their positions. And here he is down on his hands and knees, you know, adjusting Angela's clothes and uh, getting everybody ready for the shot. It was quite a fluid situation, uh, like a family portrait, a formal portrait, but the characters and people playing off each other, uh, just having a lot of fun. It really caught the spirit of it.